Hi everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to update about the um, Route 2. So the Route 2 update for Virginia um, PEBT. Um, so you know, like in the past, um, the PEBT has already uh, come out since March when the school is closed. So now it is uh, crowd to when school beginnings. So students who are learning visually for at least five days consecutive date, uh, they are eligible for PEBT. Also the student who uh, eligible for free or reduced price meal uh, are also eligible for receiving PEBT benefit for this fall. Um, so if you receive the PEBT benefit this past spring or summer, the new benefit will be automatically added to your cart. You don't have to do anything. Uh, it will be automatic add to your cart. Um, so the community eligible um, or the school that eligible for uh, EBPT is the Oscar Mid Middle, Camot Elementary, Canva Intermediate, Port Lock Primaries, Rena Bright Ramanry, Thurgood Marshall Elementary, Tickle Elementary, Truth Intermediate, Norfolk Highland Primaries, Crest Food Intermediate, Georgetown Primaries, Southwest Elementaries, Key Peak Center for Student Success, SECEP, Scar Scarborough Road Intermediate, and BM William Primaries. So those community also eligible uh, to um, for the student who in those school also eligible for receive the PEBT. So the benefit will be issued between the September 30 and the October 15th. So by the end of this month, um, the amount will be automatically loaded into your account if you add the past receiver uh, PEBD benefit. So what happened next? So if you existing PEBD or EBT card, it will be automatically loaded with the benefit. If you don't have a card, a reload Virginia PEBT card, it will come in the mail uh, to the address that the parents or the guardian name um, that lists in the local school division record. Um, and if you lost it or discard your PEBT card, you can call the number on the screen, one 866 Two a one two four four a. They will be helping you to um, get the new one. So, what if your child already received the SNAP benefit? So, if you receive the SNAP benefit, or they can call food stamp in the past, uh, it will be automatically load into your SNAP card for most of the families, um, and if. In case if the state were not able to match your information, then the card will be sent it to you. Um, so you don't have to worry about that, okay? Um, another question uh, that people, common question that people always have is, what if I lost or threw away my card? So since like March until June, a lot of families, uh, especially who have the student going to school, they receive the PEBT card. And during the summer, uh, the state uh, not, you don't have the benefit of that. You're not eligible for receiving the benefit. So there is the gap now. So now the school stack back. Um, and, you know, some family thought this, you know, I don't need it anymore. So you throw away after you use it. So what happened if you lot or drew your card? Um, you can call the number um, on the screen, 1-866-281-2448 to request a replacement card. 
um, and allow seven to 10 business day for mailing process. So how do you activate the card if you are the new one, um, the first time receiving it? Um, you know, I will show you the direction um, later on, but also the detail of how to set up your PIN card and activate your card is uh, included in the envelope with the card. So make sure don't throw it away. Um, they have the instruction for you. But if your card already activates in March, May or, you know, March, May uh, or June, uh, you don't need to do anything. Uh, it will be automatically uh, uploaded. So you just reuse this. Um, so there is three way for you to activate the new PEBT card um, or manage your benefit. You can either call the phone number one 866 281 or go to the connectebt.com and download the app, um, you know, uh, on your mobile device. Um, you log on to those websites and uh, you will be able to activate your card or manage the benefit. Um, so this is the instruction how to activate your card. So like I mentioned, there is three options, right? Um, the first option is call. The second option, you can go directly to um, the website, connectebt.com and download the app on your mobile phone. Um, but when you call, um, you usually call the number on the back of your card. And then they will ask you to enter the EBT, the PEBT card number, which is located in the front of your card. Uh, and then the second step is enter the day of your, of your child who receive the benefit. Um, and the last one, this is very important. A lot of people make a mistake. Um, when is prom asking enter the last four digits of your social security number, a lot of people enter um, your real uh, child social number, uh, which is doesn't work. So you need, when it's happened, when they ask enter the last four digits of your social security number, then you just enter four, zero, 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 four number zero to replace the last four digits of your social security number. Um, and then the last step they will asking you is enter the four digits pin number. You can create any number that you would like that easy for you to remember. Um, you know, for example, like the years of your child's, uh, any kind of number that you would like. So that will be your pin number for your card from now on when you're using it. Um, so just emphasize the importance. When they asking to enter the last four digits of your social security number, do not enter your real social security number. Just enter four number zero, 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 zero to replace it, okay? Um, so another question asking is, how do you use your card? Um, you know, this card is just similar to the SNAP, uh, the food stamp. So this card will be helping you, this benefit helping you and your family to purchase the food anywhere eligible food items, accepting the SNAP card. Um, and then you just swipe it after you purchase and then enter the last, the pin number you just create. Um, every single time you sub, just enter your pin number. Swipe it and enter the PIN number. So the, the card can be used at the point of sale device, just like a debit card or handle to the cashier. Um, and how much will be on the card? So for Virginia, um, the benefit amount will be very uh, depend on when your school open for the new school year. And if your school is operate 100% virtual or hybrid model. So it's very depend. And do you have to use the benefit at all at once? No, you don't need to. 
the money in the card is carry over um, for a year. So if you're not able to use all of them, they will be staying there and then you can reuse for the next time and then it will be expired after one year. Um, if you would like to receive a replacement card, if your card is lost, uh, damage or anything, just call the number on the phone, on the screen, 1-866-281-2448. Uh, there will be someone uh, to help you and answer your question. Thank you very much for um, watching my uh, videos uh, and visit my channel. Um, if you're not surprised my channel yet, um, please do show. Uh, so when I have a new come up uh, videos, um, you will get notified. Uh, and if you already did, uh, thank you very much for supporting and uh, subscribe my channel. You just need to do only one time. How you know? Um, look on the bottom of the screen, you know, uh, and you see the surprise button right here, the red with the um, play button. If it's, it's still in red, that means you're not doing so. Uh, so please submit it. If it's already in gray color, that means you're already done. Uh, then you don't need to do any more, just only one time. Uh, thank you and look forward to see you on the next video.